Hey yo, what is up guys? It's the Nerd Life back with another video, and I know this is a little bit different. Today, I'm going to be doing a unboxing, and I'm going to be unboxing the brand new Google Pixel 2. So this phone did just come out about a month and a half, two months ago. So, I mean, I I'm kind of glad I have it, but I'm gonna go through over, I'm gonna go over like the specs, uh, the good things, the bad things, and stuff like that. So, I'm gonna go ahead and move my camera. So this is my phone right here, the uh, white. So I did get mine a few days ago, so I already have opened it, set it up, and did all that. But here's the uh, charger. I couldn't get this back in. I was trying to set it up like normal and then everything like that. And I was just gonna go ahead and tell you guys I already opened it. But this is the uh, charging cable right here. It is a, a USB Type C. If I can, USB Type C right there. And then the other side of it is also a USB type C. So this is the charging cable it comes with. Now the brick and everything else is inside of the phone. So here's the box right here. Google Pixel 2. It will have the color phone you have. I have the white version. Like my brother, he has the kind of blue version. So his is the kind of blue. So this is the front right here. It says Google Pixel 2. Google, Google logo, sorry about my dog, flip it on its side, you have like the side of the phone, on this side it just says Google Assistant built in, right there, and then the back it just says hashtag Team Pixel, let me go ahead and get that for you guys, hashtag Team Pixel, so now this is the opening of it I just had to move my camera so you guys can see a little bit better so when you open it up this is what you see at first is the phone now yours should be shut off like I said I already set mine up so mine when you set it up it asks if you want it to be on always on or always off and I have mine set to always on so when it detects a light source or something like that it will instantly turn on like this so say it's like that then all all it is right now is just a black screen as soon as you take it off the timer will well the clock will come on and everything so if you're at a party and it's on like a table or something like that then it will always be showing the clock so that's my notification right there i got class royal notification so let me go ahead and get the, the phone out all right so now that that's a little truck tricky to get out right there is the initial packaging that the phone comes in it has the uh, buttons and I think yeah I put my phone in there wrong it's supposed to be in there like this and the only reason I know is because the buttons so this is really what you would see not the black screen sorry about that like I did say I got mine Friday so I don't really remember so when it, you open it it should be like that so then you guys can just go ahead and just get that out so here's the phone so we're just gonna go ahead and set this off to the side right there and continue opening everything so here's the be safe paper it just talks about like the reference guide and basic safety uh, hardware stuff like that stuff you don't really need to know if you're just buying the phone to have the phone if you're a tech guy this is something you might want to look into The important consumer safety, this is something that if you're just buying the phone to have the phone, you don't really need to go through. And then you have the let's get started. This pretty much just tells you how to set it all up. And it shows everything it comes with right here. So it comes with the phone, clearly. You might want that. comes with the SIM tool. The power adapter. The quick switch, which what you'll do is you'll plug that into your phone and then it has a little USB port right there that's what the bigger part is and you'll put the USB into it and then the other part of it into your old phone so you can switch over the data you want and then the USB type C cable so let's go ahead and set that over there as well so you open this I can't remember what was in here honestly I wanna say this was where the uh, SIM tool was but I, I, I don't really remember I don't think I actually took mine out. No, it's still in here. Wow, I didn't even take my SIM tool out. It's still there. So here's your SIM tool. 
Now, when we get to the phone, I'll show you what this and how it's used. So we're gonna set that over there with the phone. Go ahead and put that over on the side as well. And then this is where the quick adapter comes in. It should be just right here. I've already used mine, so I mean, mine's probably sitting out in the living room. And then here is the actual charger and everything else that you pretty much needed was in the bottom of the box because this is it there's nothing left in the box so we don't need that right now we don't need the top of the box so here is the go ahead and wait to show you guys that here's the power brick right here see there's the USB type C you plug that in there and then you also plug it into your phone and then here's the headphone adapter you plug it that part into your phone and then plug that well plug your headphones in there I don't have any headphones that are like this so I don't really need this adapter because I use Bluetooth go ahead and set that off to the side as well we'll put this right no we'll just put it down here kinda wanna keep some of the stuff still in view so you guys can kinda see it but not too much so we'll just keep that right there so now here's the actual phone so this is the part that you guys are pretty much been hanging on your seats to see is the actual phone so here's the sim tool again we'll set that to the side we're gonna put it up here so it's easier to grab go ahead and get my phone out and as you guys can see it the timer came on and when it was in here I don't know oh no I can't do it again so yeah pretty much oh just knocked over the mic sorry about that so pretty much when I took the phone out it I saw a timer come on and everything so you have the fingerprint scanner on the back that's really good you know it's always where your index finger will be so after you turn the phone on it stops scanning see my phone turned on it stopped scanning you got the camera the flash and all that then on the side this is where the power button and the volume button is and then on this side this is where sim card will go so this is when you get your sim tool and you put it down in this hole and that, that's supposed to be how it comes out I, I can't remember how you do it but I do know this the sim tool goes in this hole and it brings it out that way if I can get it here alright well I appear it appears I cannot get it but so here's the phone you sh you guys will go through the startup and then I, I, I already went through it so you hit that right there turns the phone on and then you swipe up you got all your applications and it also comes with AR stickers which when you're recording you can put stickers on the up here if I can try to get it to focus well, up there sort of about right maybe I can get like the pull on it almost so about right there all the way through that little line that you guys can barely see that is the speaker so it has two front speakers and then the talk is down here as well obviously so when you're watching videos you don't need to set it up like that and then kind of scoot stuff out from behind it because it plays through there so now also when it's on it's off mode instead of fingerprint instead of the fingerprint you can hit the power button it'll bring it up to here you'll have all your notifications you can swipe all them out then it says fingerprint which means you can use your fingerprint device will stay locked until you manually unlock it so then you just type your password in right here so I'm gonna go ahead and go do that and that's pretty much that in the settings there is a few different things you can do 
as well, but I haven't set everything up yet because I'm still kind of learning, and that's Discord. See, that, I just got in my phone like that. Discord loading up. I'm here. Shut my phone off. I need back in. Boom. Right back in. Shut it off. Boom. Right back in. That's how easy it is. Alright, so, there's also the Google Assistant I was talking about. And all you have to do to activate this, you guys should set it up when you first get your phone. You just squeeze the side, and Google Assistant will come up. And then you also have the OK Google, that. And then you also have, there's a new feature on the phone. Now, I'm going to kind of move stuff real fast and talk. So, with this new feature of the uh, phone, what it's doing is it's showing you guys um the music so say you're in a restaurant and you hear a song you like and you don't know the song name so you're like okay i'm just gonna go ahead and look it up well you guys still can't find it no matter how hard you try to look it up nothing so you guys just give up well what it will do is at the bottom of the phone oh right here it will say what song is playing because the phone now has a feature that allows it to always be on. So the mic picks up everything. Everything you guys say, it just Google people, the people that work at Google don't get to know all that info. It just picks everything up. So that's pretty much that. That is the uh, Google Pixel 2 unboxing. This is my first unbox video that I've done on the channel. Uh, Christmas is coming up soon. So, I mean, that's more unbox videos I could do. And hope you guys did go ahead and enjoy. It's the No Life. Signing out. Peace.